All right, you guys, I am on live and I am putting it out there today. It's going to be my last day at work. I am coming in. I am going to participate as if I am excited about everything. But the thing is, is I'm actually about to get me a plane ticket to the Republic of Congo. I am moving over to Africa. I am going to learn the language, you guys. And first thing first, I'm going to that mountain, and I'm going to get me a gold piece. Now, I know I need to get over there as fast as I can before the Europeans or uh, the Portuguese or uh, the Spanish get over there to the Congo and disrupt everything. So... After work today, I will be letting my supervisor know that today will be my last day because I need to get over there to the Congo to get me a bit of that gold. Now, this is amazing that something like that has happened in this time of 2021, right? You guys, it's so much gold still. It's so much untold. In, on the continent of Africa, you guys. So, yeah, I may need to go ahead and move. Or uh, if, you know, they won't allow me in the... I mean, it's going to be some stuff. I already know. When I get on that plane, they might stop all blacks. You can't be black to go to the Congo. You might just have to be European or Spanish or, or, or Portuguese or Persian or something like that to get to the Congo. So... I better try to get that as fast as I can. I was waiting on my income tax, but... I'm going to have to say, you know, to hell with those income tax. I'm calling up my friends, Patrick, uh, Anthony. I mean, I need at least $1,000 a piece. I think that that flight might be at least about $3,000. do not worry about a round-trip ticket. I'll make my way back. Once I get there, I'll just figure everything out. You guys, I am excited about this move. Hopefully it works out for me, but I'm a little scared because I know how history uh I know what happened. I know how things work when it comes to, you know, these findings of gold, you know, silver and gold. So I'm going to try my best to get over there to the Congo as fast as I can. And then once I get over there, I'm still going to have to deal with the locals. So, I mean, it's going to be a battle, but I bet you I'm going to get me some of that gold. And maybe I could live like the, uh, the Caucasian Congolese. I mean, I'm sure they live really, really well. But until then, you guys, I'll be signing out. Check me out in the Congo soon.